Welcome to Is English by Dishing and today we are going to continue once again the lesson class 10 Madam Writes Slippers. This time we are going to discuss question answers. Marshi, the very first question that I am going to ask you is that what was Valia's favorite pastime? Sir, Valia's favorite pastime was to stand on the front doorway of her house and just to see the bus passing through her street from her town to the next town and coming back back from there. Very good. Can you tell me why did she do so? Sir, she did this because it was the most fascinating thing for her. And most importantly, she had no playmates of yes, her age. Of her she age. had no one to play with her. Am I right? From whom she yeah, could yeah, yeah. spend she, her time. She had no one of her age who could be her playmates. Am I right? Yes. That was also another reason. Okay. Second question. How did Valley save money to travel by bus? Sir, Valley was very economically saved to, um, to travel by bus. She, she economically saved all that all the she resisted money. all the I mean all the temptation yes, all the temptation to buy to buy a clothes, paper mints yes sir toys balloons uh, uh, balloons and to ride a um, merry go round, round. merry go round yes sir at the village sir, square round. yeah to yes, save sir. money that means whatever straight coins came on her way yes, she, saved. she saved she saved them. Them. whatever straight coins came her way whatever straight coins whatever straight coins came her way away. She accepted them. She accepted that. She accepted them. She, accept she resisted every temptation to buy paper mints, toys, balloons, and ride on the money go round. Uh, she didn't even go on. Uh, I mean the uh, merry go round and uh, at the village square. And this way, she saved money for uh, her journey. For her journey. Okay. Let's see. Third question. Mm -hmm. What was the most fascinating thing that valley? saw in the street the same as acha i will say um the most fascinating thing about valley was that uh, she always stand on the front doorway of her house uh, and uh, just saw the bus uh, which was traveling from her village to the nearest town the nearest town very good how did valley gather in all information about the bus sir over many days and years uh, valley was uh, listening to the conversation between the passengers uh, and her Neighbors. Neighbors. Hmm. She also asked some discreet questions to them like uh, how much time did it take to travel or uh, how much cost did it take? What was the cost the of fare? What was fear. the total fare? Yes. 30 pies per way, isn't yes, it? Sir. What kind of person is Valley? Sir, Valley was a de determined, confident and brave girl. She was also a good planner. She sacrificed a lot of things. Say, to achieve her dream, to achieve her desire. for example, yes, sir. She re reduced the temptation, she reduced the temptation to buy sweets and riding on the merry go round. She also behaved confidently in the bus yes, and sir. did not get agitated and disturb the uh, passengers. Am I yes, right? Yes, yes, sir. What uh, does Valley tell the elders when he calls her a child? Sir Valley replied that there was no one in the bus who was a child. She also paid uh, 30 paise as everyone do. And that's why she said that she was not at all she a was child. Not at all she a was child. just like an adult. Just like an adult. Though she was a child. Though yes, she was a child. So what was the source of unending joy for Valley? The sight of uh, seeing the bus passing from her village to the nearest town was the most uh, unending joy for Valley. Very good. Now we are continuing conversation. Come this side. Nowadays, Mercy, what happens? Mercy, nowadays, what happens? That there is a craze among students, you know. Yes, sir. Well, do you know what is the craze? Yes. Craze, craze. Yes, they are sir. very much fond of. Fond of. Uh, the, the children are very fond of. Tell me, what are they fond of nowadays? Sir, they are fond of. Uh, so, they are a performance uh, like. Um, no, no, no. Sir, to join special type of coaching, sir, like yeah, yeah, guitar. that's what I'm asking. Yes, sir. yes. to perform nowadays, academics, yeah, to, to, to perform, perform academically to better pursuit. or to achieve excellence in education. Yes, the sir. children nowadays are fond of, I mean, going Funny to coaching shoot. classes. Yes, sir. now, now it is generally seen that coaching classes are merely, you know, a source of, you know, a crowd. Rather, you yes, can sir. say they 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 okay. are not quality based. I mean, institution. 
they, they impart only those things which are required for a competitive exam. Am I right? Yes. They don't go in depth, I mean, learning. Am I right? So don't you think coaching classes are also harming the, I mean, general intelligence of the child? Yes. What is your opinion? No, Do, they are not harming the general no, intelligence. No, Marcy, what is your opinion about coaching classes? Sir, it depends upon the type of a child he or she is. Sir, because if he or she is quite generous, so sir, yeah, they could manage their time of coaching and school and they could time out um, what time they have to do self-study also, sir. It depends no, on I'm, not, I'm not blaming the coaching classes. What yes, I'm sir. saying, in general cases, coaching classes focus on the things which are, you know, pinpointed, which are yes, required sir. for a competitive exam. Mm -hmm. But actually, the real learning is depth learning, in-depth learning. Depth for learning. instance, they never focus on reading NCRT books. Do you agree or disagree? Tell me. Yes. Do they focus on reading no. NCRT books? No, no never. Sir. They only, they have got big, big books. They have got Go their own and... notes. Am I right? Yes, they have selected questions in their, I mean, guideline or they have selected question in their, you know, manuals. They, they focus on their manuals question answer. Sir, they uh, don't ask to go for it. So they focus on manual because in the NCRT, the special, the topics are not explained clearly. That's so what, that's, that's the How can the student can understand more? But better. do you think, I mean, the NCRT books, they are written by the Sir, best scholars, best yeah. scholars. And if a child is not able to comprehend the meaning of those concepts and make out the sense out of that, that means the child will never have the, you know, durable concept. Dumb Even, child. Yeah, the, the child will become just, a, you know, um, hand, Root hand, learning. hand Root fed, learning. I mean, uh, mouth. It will be just like a spoon fed mouth. When you are being given the ready-made answer of any question, where will be the depth of that? And sometimes the competitive exams like uh, IIT and JE UBC. or medicals, they test the child's depth of concept. Am I right? The comprehensive knowledge of the child. Don't you think yes, Mercy, sir, it sir, is yes, important sir. to go for NCRT book? Yes, sir. Don't you think reading yes, of sir. NCRT book is essential or not? Tell me. Yes, sir. It's essential or not? But these coaching institutions generally don't uh, ask us or don't insist children on reading of NCRT book. They only ask that you solve these hundred questions this from the manual. Yeah, inside, inside the inside book or something like they always insist. Now you tell me, uh, don't you think the parents should also monitor the child's performance? Yes, if a child yes. has joined, I mean, mm. suppose a child has joined a coaching institution. Let the parent also monitor the development of the yes, child. Sir, yes, sir. How the child is pursuing the work. Whether he is going through the, I mean, depth studies, self studies, or I mean, exploring new ideas and getting the concept better, clear cut answer or not. Whether the child is only depending upon the ready-made answers given by, ready-made solutions given by the institution. Am I right? Yes, yes. Achha, one of the areas where we really feel that uh, the the institutions can help the institutions that you are studying in like your school his school they are going to help you uh, in the long run ask how so how they are teaching you part by part every concept in details am i right so when you are getting your concept in details don't you think it is good yes sir okay marcy uh, what is the right way of Learning science. What is the best way to learn uh, science? Sir, by doing practical. By doing practical. Yes, or sir. by exploring. Yes, sir. Or by reading the text and trying to find out the uh, real answer, the logical answer. The logical answer. See, yes. if so the I child is critical in learning, see what I'm telling you. The present, I mean, uh, time, this is the time of science, this is the age of science. Every child is innovative. Every child is full of knowledge. Every, I mean, child is full of information. So don't you think critical learning can help? Yes, yes. Okay, Marcy, what do you think critical learning is? Sir, uh, critical learning. Yes, sir. Critical learning means that, sir, students should understand, sir, each and every word answer going into its depth. depth. Uh, yeah, answer. going into the depth of the answers. Yes, depth of the answer. depth of the answer. And, um, making their base strong. And what is your opinion about that? What do you think is the best way to learn science? So to understand uh, it more by the natural surroundings. By observation. Uh, by in, it helps a lot in yeah, biology. Observation is one way. Yes. You are right. Observation, observation is another way. Yeah, yeah. But uh, uh, besides observation, 
it is also important to apply the learning to the day to day i mean happening Again, MRI. Yes, like there are many things that uh, that are happening and they are related to science am i right yes, so many experiments are taking taking place day by day am i right yes, Achha, tell, tell me how do you think internet is going to help learn science better internet so by watching youtube videos yes sir ideas yes, yes, youtube yes. channel like fact is yes ah, fact is. Achha, yes. but but there's you know but there are certain channels on youtube which are not reliable yes sir. so how to i mean save i mean how to save the children from false i mean ideas yes, and by not giving the phone uh, and then, then if you will not allow to the phone, then how will they watch you YouTube? Internet. That's yeah. not the problem. Now let the child understand what is right and what is wrong. Let the child judge which I mean material, study material is good for him and which is bad for him. Am I right? The child is now grown up. Every yes, child is now intelligent. Yes, if the child is sincere about, about their studies, yeah, he, they can. They uh, have. Don't you think uh, the child is able to distinguish between good study is material good and, and yes, poor sir. study material? Yes, sir. Thank you. It is a nice discussion. Thanks a lot. It will